Hello and welcome to another episode. In the second episode of this two-parter on white balance, we will look at the two advanced white balancing options in a Sony camera. In part one of white balance, we saw in the menu that white balance can be adjusted by navigating to the page titled Color White Balance Image Processing 1. But for a quicker way to access this, you can press the function menu button and white balance is a preset on the second row. Select white balance, and the first of the two settings we will look at is the custom option. Custom white balance will have the camera analyze a segment within the scene and adjust the white balance value to correspond with the amount of reflected light. For the best results, you want the camera to predominantly analyze a completely white area under the lighting conditions you will be shooting in. This method is a quick and accurate way to white balance. The downside, however, is if the quality of light changes, such as the environment gets darker or brighter, this may throw out your white balance that you have set through this process, and you will need to adjust the white balance again. The second advanced white balance option is the color temperature filter. This will allow you to manually set the camera's Kelvin temperature value, which are moved in 100 unit increments. Adjusting the white balance in this way can allow you to very quickly match white balance from other cameras or to match to a previous image or video. In most cases, particularly for photography, the range of Sony cameras have a great ability to correctly adjust white balance, so auto white balance is a strong setting. And that completes part two in adjusting and customizing the white balance in your Sony camera. Thanks for tuning in again, and we'll see you in the next one.